How old are you? 13. What eating disorder do you have? Um, I have adenos. When did you develop your eating disorder? Um, when I was around nine or 10. How did you develop the eating disorder and why did you start? Well, it's like, you know, the incessant need and like want to be pretty. Does this have anything to do with beauty standards? No, not really. I just want to appear like attractive to other people. What do you think of body image? I don't really think much of it. Like it doesn't really matter as much to me. I don't care as much about my body. I think it's more I've got to do with how my facial features look. Like my body is okay. Like I can work with it, but my face is atrocious. What do you think of beauty standards and have they affected you? Well, they haven't affected me so much. I always know there's going to be girls prettier, skinnier, and smarter than me. My eating disorder was and still is just a constant battle against myself. How come it's a battle against yourself? What are you fighting? My insecurities and the, the setbacks that come with an eating disorder, like binging, purging, weight fluctuation, and all that other shit. What do you think has contributed or fueled your eating disorder? Well, I mean, all this mostly stems for, uh, from my standard of like wanting to look perfect and pretty for other people. Like the fact that I just feel so undesirable and ugly when I'm eating is just pretty yucky. Like I really internalize the whole pretty girls don't eat thing. And there's also a bunch of like, you know, those like, I don't know, like social media forums online that like feel like and like promote eating disorders, things like that. What do you have to gain from an eating disorder? To validate myself and to be happy with how I look and like come off to other people. Um, I remember you said something about a sense of control in the past. Um, does that still apply to you? I suppose it it kind of does, but I guess like it varies. I guess like my desire, like like my desire to be like pretty, and my eating disorder generally is like deeply rooted in my childhood trauma. What do you do to lose weight and maintain a certain weight? I'm one of the laziest chicks with an eating disorder. I virtually never exercise or stay at home and starve. What has helped in the past and what didn't? I mean, nothing really helps. Encouragement from friends and family doesn't help either. They always end up like triggering the shit out of me. And then like, I don't want to open up about it or fix myself anymore. What role does therapy play for you? Also, what are some things that people have said to you with the intention to help that just ended up backfiring? I mean, therapy is shit if you don't want to actually recover. Forced recovery doesn't really work either. To recover from an eating disorder, you have to want to recover yourself. And um, compliments that people give you when you were thinking about recovery are like ours, like 90% of the time. Like, I recommend you shutting up before triggering your friend. What is stopping you from recovering? During the summer of 2021, I reached my lowest weight. I wasn't all that happy with the way my body looked, but I was more, you know, excited about how pretty my face looked. It'd be impossible to reach that weight again from like a normal or healthy diet and like exercise routine. I'd rather do it my way. Um, were you still discontent with your body because you wanted it to be skinnier or something else? Does it play a role in your will to recover? I wasn't discontent with my body. I just didn't really care. I just wanted my facial features to be pretty.